Hi, Misho. Yes, what's up? What's up? Okay. Um, please tell us about gig culture. Uh, gig culture is, is we're just trying to build a tech community for IT students to connect IT students um, nationally on a national scale. So they can share ideas, work together, collaborate, uh, take part in events. Like we've had previous events in the past, like the hackathons. Um, we connect them with some of them with companies, or some of them get jobs. And, um, you know, it's just a platform for people to just showcase their skills, eh? So, yeah, that's, that's what Key Culture is basically all about. When did you start Key Culture? Uh, and that's a funny story because we started off um, Key Culture, it was called Innovators IT initially. Mm -hmm. So, we had to change the name because of some legal issues we came across to Key Culture. So, no regrets. So, it officially started this year, the beginning of this year. So, right now, we're just still trying to put things together, build it, and just watch it. Watch, watch out. That's going to be big. Upcoming events? Um, phew, there's quite a lot of events coming. Um, the, the one that I can think of is so the one that's happening this weekend. There's a Seed Engine uh, Hackathon. Um, then there's one happening on the 19th, which is a Tech for Africa Hackathon. And then there's, on the 5th, there's another event. Hopefully I'll be pitching there. And then there's another one, uh, SA Innovation Summit. Um, so busy taking videos, to interviewing different speakers for the SA Innovation Summit. And then the one that I'm also part of is on the 27th of September, TEDx Pretoria. It's going to be happening at the Innovation Hub, so watch out for that. It's going to be boss. Oh, all right. Um, do you have to, like, to have IT or to study IT for you to join Geek Culture? No, um, Geek Culture, as much as we try to build it as a tech community, it's, mm -hmm. it covers everything, really. Um, in the sense that it's IT, you know, your programming, your business analysis, your web dev, robotics. We've got some guys playing around with robotics, uh, some doing mobile apps, um, getting creative people as well, like designers, uh, uh, you know, graphic designers, those kind of people. So it's just a matter of if you're into technology, then you geek culture is your home. All right. Your contact details? Uh, my contact details are just catch me at. Um, I'm on Facebook, so just have a check out the Facebook uh, Geek Culture page, it's called well, Geek Culture, and then there's a Geek Culture uh, Twitter handle, so it's G-E-E-K-U-L-C-H-A, that's, that's where Geek Culture is from, or oh, you can check it out, I think, yeah, that's the one, you can write it there, that's Geek Culture, so this is the culture, <laughs> not culture as most people tend to say it, so um, we'll link there and we'll definitely connect. So if you've got some cool stuff that you're working on, um, give me a shout, let me know about it, and then we'll try to promote it, we'll try to get it out there so people can see what you're doing. All right, thanks, Mr. Shemisha, for your time. All right, peace.